In this video, we will explore a popular instructional design approach for blended learning, the ADDIE model, and an approach that works well with blended learning, flipped learning. The ADDIE model was developed by the Center for Educational Technology at Florida State University in 1975. It is a popular approach for instructors because it is systematic. It is an iterative process. It is learner-centered. It aligns objectives, strategies, and learning experiences. It is flexible and works well in blended learning and other formats. It has been successful for decades in multiple fields. The ADDI model consists of five key phases, analysis, design, development, implementation, and evaluation. Let's take a closer look at each of these phases and how they contribute to creating effective blended learning experiences. In the analysis phase, instructors, identify the target audience and their learning needs, determine the learning objectives and goals, and assess the available resources, technology, and constraints for both online and in-person learning components. During the design phase, instructors write objectives, develop assessments, and create a plan for what content will be online and what will be in person. In the development phase, instructors create online video scripts and presentations and classroom activities such as lecture notes and handouts. Develop interactive online activities, quizzes, and assignments that promote active learning, and set up the learning management system. During the implementation phase, instructors Deliver the blended or hybrid course, ensuring a seamless integration of online and offline learning experiences, and monitor student progress and provide timely feedback and support both online and in person. Finally, in the evaluation phase, instructors. Assess student learning outcomes using a variety of methods, such as online quizzes, projects, and in-class assessments. Gather feedback from students on the effectiveness of the blended course and Make necessary revisions to the course content, structure, and delivery methods based on the evaluation results. By following the ADDIE model, instructors can create effective and engaging blended or hybrid learning experiences that meet the needs of their target audience and achieve the desired learning outcomes. In this chapter, you will be focused on the design and development stage where you decide on activities and develop those activities for your blended course. Another popular approach to instructional design in blended learning environments is flipped learning. Flipped learning is an instructional approach where students gain first exposure to new material outside of class, usually via reading or lecture videos, and then use class time to do the work of assimilating that knowledge through problem solving, discussion, or other activities. The concept of flipped learning is attributed to Jonathan Bergman and Aaron Sams, two chemistry teachers who began using recorded lectures in 2007. In their 2012 book, Flip Your Classroom, Reach Every Student in Every Class Every Day, they outline the fundamental principles of this approach. Provide first exposure to content prior to class through videos or readings. Provide incentives for students to prepare for class such as reading or video quizzes or provide in-class activities that focus on higher level cognitive activities. The main idea is to shift the lower levels of Bloom's taxonomy, remembering and understanding outside of the classroom while focusing on the higher levels of Bloom's taxonomy, applying, analyzing, evaluating, and creating in class with teacher support. This allows for a more student-centered, active learning environment. It is possible to combine flipped learning with the ADDIE model or backward design. 